Over the past few years, we have seen an increase in concern for the environment and a shift in people being more environmentally conscious and trying to be more sustainable. This has come alongside increases in climate crisis events, including wildfires in Australia, mass flooding and hurricanes in America. In Britain, the Ipsomira report revealed in August that public concerns about the environment have jumped 16% since July. With concerns growing, I wanted to look at what local governments are doing to try and be more environmentally sustainable. Councillor Kevin Maguire, Chair of CEEP and Cabinet Member for Safe and Sustainable City Environment said, Our Norwich 2040 City Vision commits us to maintaining a livable city for future generations. To help us accomplish a more environmentally friendly city, Norwich Council has an environmental strategy that proposes working with their partners to mobilise residents, businesses and all stakeholders to take action on climate change and resource use. Another way Norwich Council encourages others to take on a more sustainable approach is through the Norwich and Norfolk Eco Awards. The Norwich and Norfolk Eco Awards recognise unsung environmental individuals, projects and schemes with a strong ecological or environmentally friendly ethos. So how are local businesses becoming more environmentally friendly? I spoke to G Gallant, director of the Yard Coffee in Norwich. With things changing, with global warming, with the climate crisis all happening, coffee will change. And then in countries where we will see that change drastically soon. We work with, with direct training, so we know exactly where the coffee is coming from. We know the farmer. We use an importer um, who brings the beans straight across from Brazil to Norwich. So we have a direct link with the farm. If they need to put up their prices for whatever reason, or um, this year there was a really bad frost in Brazil, we can have that conversation with him. We can decide whether we need to pay more for the beans. And that's something that we can have that sincere chat about. And I love being able to do that. I feel that's really supportive of you know, where our coffee comes from is really important. So we pay our farmer directly in US dollars, so it's better conversion rate for them. And then it gets roasted in Norwich, so it goes straight from Brazil to Norwich. I feel like it's nice to know that things are being kept local. We only supply, like all our suppliers are local for things like our cakes. All of our cakes and bakes are them within the radius of Norwich City Centre. And I think Norwich is growing in independence day by day. I'm really excited for it to continue being more internationally led and we can support the farmers.